guys, as I told you, as I've been telling you, as I've been giving you all the details of Ghana Blasters technical team, and as I've been saying that uh, Otuado, George uh, Boateng, then Chris uh, Houston, then Didi Dramani will be given the mandate, will be given the job to uh, uh, for the Blasters to qualify Blaster for AFCON 2023 in Ivory Coast and also take Ghana to the World Cup is here and it's finally here and I'll be giving him the details of their contract right here, right now on Bedu News TV. Guys, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification button, share, like and comment as I told you. So uh, this evening, all the Blasters of Ghana uh, job has been given to uh Otuado as the head coach, Chris uh Houston as a technical advisor, George Boatin and Didi Dramani also have been reappointed uh to lead as uh, assistant coaches to lead the blasters of Ghana till December 2022. And they also guide uh, uh, Ghana to the qualifiers of African Cup of uh, Nations. Now, now let me let me let me let me give you this uh, details on the contract as uh, GFA Ghana Football Association are uh, saying. Let me give it to you right here, right now on Bedu News TV. Subscribe to the channel, guys. Subscribe to the channel. This is what this is what the FA said. said GFA reposes confidence in Blasters technical team. Otuado said to take Ghana to Qatar 2020. So that was the caption that Ghana Football Association posted on their official website. And they continue to say that the Ghana Football Association has appointed Otuado, Chris Houston, George Boateng, and Maseudu Didi Draman as the coaches of the senior national team, the Blasters of Ghana, until the end the end of 2022 uh, december that's after the world cup he said that the, the masterminded that does the otuado and his master his other uh coach he said the mastermind the qualification to the fifa world cup 2022 at Qatar, and they will also take uh, ghana to that World Cup and so prepare Ghana for the World Cup and also uh, take Ghana qualification that is the 2023 African Commission qualifi qualification yes they will take in charge so this follow an um, extensive negotiation and engagement with all the relevant stakeholders including the Ministry of Youth and Sports the coaches will soon name their squad for March Day 1 and March Day 2 of Total Energy African Cup of uh, Nation Cote d'Ivoire 20 23 and the four uh four nation tournament in japan so ghana is having four nation tournament in japan as i told you guys in hey, otuado and uh george button and also marcel did the germany then chris houston are the technical team for the blasters of ghana and they'll be naming their squad you know everything i say is uh is, is coming everything i've been telling you is true everything that I'll give it to you. Guys, you have seen that I'm not lying to you. I told you, George Boateng, Chris Houston, uh, it's rhyming, George Boateng, Chris Houston, then also myself, did the Dramani, then Otuado. These guys will lead the Blasters to the African Cup of Nations. And also, the most important one, to the World Cup. These are the guys that beat Nigeria to qualify for the World Cup in Qatar 2022. These same guys also are taking Ghana to the uh, World Cup and also they will take Ghana to Afghan Cup of Nations 2023. That's, they will do the qualification and I know George Barton and Otuado, Chris Houston and, and uh, Masao Didamani will also be the same coaches that will take Ghana to uh, Afghan Cup of Nations 2020. This is Bedu News TV guys. My name is Kofi Atika Atika One. Subscribe to the channel, hit the notification button, share, like and comment. Hit the notification button because anything that goes on here will be the first place you got to know. You hear it, you later you listen it to the details. George Barton, Chris Houston, Otuado, Didi Dramani, these guys are taking Ghana to the World Cup 2022 in Qatar and also four nation tournament. Four nation tournament in Japan that will be in June. So this is 
confirmation from Ghana Football Association. Their website is saying it and it's final. It's out. It's out. It's Betty News TV. Piao.